All right, it is winter time, which means it's that time of year where you're gonna be out by the lake or out at the campsite, you know, maybe in your own backyard, sitting around a fire. And for that, I have Bigfoot bushcraft. Let me focus that. They sent me some of these fire plugs and very nice uh, ferro rod. I love this thing. Very easy to start a fire. There you go. So we have 10, the bag full of those things. They are small. Might have too many in here. Just refilled it, I've been using it a lot. There you go. They smell like watermelon candy. It's almost like a fiberglass type similar material uh, it, without the itch. You break them apart, fluff them up, put it in the fire pit, spark it with the ferro rod, and they will burn for a long enough time to get an actual fire going. They'll burn for a while. Uh, and they're waterproof, they'll work in the rain, and I have a discount code for you. I'm going to put that right here. So if you're planning on sitting out by the fire pit this winter and enjoying the outdoors with some warmth, check out the link in the description and use that code. So let's get into today's video. See, I'm thinking they're hanging out in the slack water on the edges of the current, so I'm throwing into the current and bringing it out. Places. For some reason, my camera wasn't on. I thought I had it on. It's funny how they get smaller as soon as I turn the camera on. <laughs> Dang, these are good hooks. Can't get it out of there. Oh, come on, man. It's bending the hook instead of coming out like that. This hook might be a little too good. Break off the barb. Well, I didn't get the fight on video, but, you know, here we go. Oh, he hit right out here in front of us. If you look, you can see where the vegetation is, and like on the other side where the current is, there's none. It's probably hiding down in that. Came up underneath it. What time y'all doing dinner? Six thirty? Oh, you got one? Good one. Come over here, yeah. Just keep that tension. He's not that big, but oh yeah, he is. Oh, he looks smaller under the water. Ooh. There you go. That's a good one. Two pounder? Yeah. Large mouth? Oh yeah. <laughs> See as soon as I turn around to check my phone. I think I got one too. Nope, thought I did, but it's just a snail. I caught a snail. Oh, the hook went through. That thing went through. That's freaking weird. That's, uh, yeah. The line's right through. Twice. Damn. I never seen that. It must have, like, wrapped around some kind of loop, and then the loop went through. I've never seen this, either. Yeah. Oh, dang. <laughs> you want me to cut it off? It's one of those invasive snails, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, you know what? Yeah, I'm going to cut it off up here. Yeah, it's fine. 
All right, thank you. It's the uh, invasive snail. It's a live one too. It's not just a shell. Okay. Can't throw it back. Oh, there's a chair up there. <laughs> you throw it and it hits the chair and it goes right Bounces the back. <laughs> Highly invasive. Can't throw those back. The chair? <laughs> no, you can't throw the chairs back either. Oh, there's one chasing it. He's got it, he's got it. Is he hooked? <laughs> he wasn't hooked. Yeah, I gotta cut it down now. There's definitely action today. Yeah. A little break in the weather. Yep, they're active. <laughs> Did he come? Oh, he came off too. Hey, Greg. I don't want to be that guy, but you've got all this area to put your tackle bag down. Oh, I flopped right there. And you put it right in the middle of a puddle. I didn't. I flopped it right there. And it uh huh. Let go. That's nice. <laughs> I can't leave right there. Yep, there's definitely ones in there. Oh, he came off. Oh, you know why I keep, I keep losing them? I broke the barb off. To get the, the first fish didn't want to come off, so I broke off the barb. That's why I keep losing them. I don't know why I didn't think about that till right now. There we go. Oh, he came off too. What the hell? Got him. Oh, come on. So I, hope, I hope he can get out of there. <laughs> it should be alright. Now, I switched out hooks. So, Maybe I shouldn't be losing them. That one did. And I set the hook on him, but I just didn't... I don't know. Oh, you got one? Little one? On the crank? On the crankbait? <laughs> yeah, fingerling? <laughs> About that long. Rick! <laughs> oh, you did catch a fish. Is that bass? Yeah. I might have to get over there around y'all, though. I don't know here. if I can. Be careful here. Come over 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 here. Come Lay down to get him though. Yeah. Not that big, but I got really lightweight line. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Bryce, come here. Come here. <laughs> I've never seen a real fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Out of its aquarium and everything. <laughs> I don't think he's ever yeah. seen a fish before. Can you yeah. want to touch it? Here, what? Right here, right. if you there do you it go. like here, this. Here, touch it again, Bryce. It yeah, you can feel the, touch it one it's more like time. sandpaper if you go that way. One way is real smooth, the other way is real rough. Yeah, this one's like sandpaper. This one is like soft. <laughs> you want to touch it one more time, Bryce? Oh. For a picture. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, sir. I no appreciate problem. it. Yo. Well, hey, that's a cool experience, man. Yeah. Hey, I'm Watch. looking. He's going to throw it now. Well, actually, I'm going to take a couple of pictures of it myself. Yeah, I'm a, me Have you ever too. Anything here? Me too. Yeah. Usually do pretty well. I just. I'm also going to take a picture as well. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> See if I can find my. Are you ready? Wow. I love that. <laughs> Wait, I'm going to watch him go. Hey, watch, watch, guys. He's going to let him go. You ready? Bye. Hey, he already oh. took off that way and splashed me. Hey, thank you so much. I appreciate it. No problem. It. <laughs> oh, 
There we go. He hit that hard. It's not even a bass, it's a catfish. I don't know why these things are going after bass lures lately. I guess Man, he's, he was not coming off either. He hit it hard, too. Yeah. It's like it's not even a predatory fish. No. Any flyers? Yeah, if you got them on you. Oh. Nah, I got some in my bag here. Yep. Nah, not yet. <laughs> he wasn't going anywhere. There we go. Some good hooks, man. <laughs> it's not a bad catfish. Yeah, good either size. <laughs> there we go. It counts. It counts. It might not help me very much. I'm still going to be under 20 inches. <laughs> it's like a three and a half inch largemouth. <laughs> oh, he's a little bigger than I thought yeah. he was. He's five inches. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Not much, but that'll put me over the twenty inches. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well that's the thing, the smaller ones are more aggressive. Uh, what is that one, like a six and a half? Six. Six, six and an eighth. But I'm gonna just round it off. 